What's up? My name is Simon and in this video I'm going to show you step by step how you can withdraw your cryptocurrency from your Binance account over to some kind of wallet or any other kind of cryptocurrency exchange and I'm also going to show you how you can withdraw your fiat currency back to your bank account. I'm going to show you everything on my computer so you can easily follow along with this video. So let's not waste any time and get started right away. So let's now look at how we can withdraw our cryptocurrency that is sitting around in our Binance account out of the exchange into some wallet or some kind of other cryptocurrency exchange. So to do that, we go to the wallet here on the top and click on overview. And then we want to click on withdraw right here on the top. And then by default, it's automatically set to a fiat currency, but we actually want to withdraw cryptocurrency. So we're going to click on crypto right here. And now we have to decide on what kind of cryptocurrency you want to actually withdraw from our Binance account. So you can click on this drop down menu that you see here and then decide on what kind of crypto you want to withdraw. And you're going to see all of your cryptos that you have sitting around in your Binance account here. So let's just keep this at Bitcoin because you want to withdraw some Bitcoin right now. And um, the recipient address is the address that you want to send it to. And it's very important that you actually type in or copy in the correct address right here. Otherwise, you might lose your coins because you can't really refund your, your, uh, your, your coins when you send it to the wrong address. Then you want to um, decide on what kind of network you want to send it in. Um, normally, a Bitcoin wallet is in the Bitcoin uh, network. So I'm going to choose a Bitcoin and then you want to type in the amount you want to send. So let's say I want to send a 0 0.5 Bitcoin. Then you're going to see how many Bitcoin you will actually receive right here because you're going to pay this amount of fee for confirming your transaction. So once everything looks good here, you can click on submit and then uh, the transfer will go through and then it will take about like 10 minutes or depending on how many transactions go are going on, it will take some time until the uh, Bitcoin is actually arriving in your other wallet or in your other cryptocurrency exchange. So let's now look at how we can convert our cryptocurrency that we have sitting around in our Binance account back to fiat currency, so euros, US dollars, British pounds, or also into other cryptocurrencies. So to do that, we can just simply head over to trade here on the top and then we're going to use the convert feature. So we're going to click on convert right here. And then we get to this very simple screen that you see here where you can just um, convert from the coins that you have sitting around in your account into either fiat currency or other cryptocurrencies. So let's say I want to convert my Bitcoin. So I'm just going to choose Bitcoin right here into, I could maybe convert it into Ethereum or I can convert it into BNB coin. But let's say I actually want to get it back to my bank account. So I have to convert it into a fiat currency. So I'm going to convert it into, let's say, euros. So I'm going to choose euros here. And then I can either type in the amount I want to convert here. You, on the top right, you can see the Bitcoin balance on your account. Or I could just click on maximum and then it will automatically put that maximum amount that you have sitting around in your account uh, into this field. And then it should automatically um, calculate how many euros you'll be getting for this amount of Bitcoin. So we can just click on preview conversion. And then we can see that we'll be getting 98 euros for this amount of Bitcoin that we have sitting around in our account. And you can see um, the, the quote that you'll be getting will be changing every like six seconds. So they will kind of um, only guarantee your price or your conversion rate for like six seconds. So you have to confirm it within those six seconds. So let's click on confirm here on convert actually. And then it should work. So as you can see, it's successfully done now. I have converted my Bitcoin into euros and I can now transfer over my euros back to my bank account or maybe buy another cryptocurrency depending on what I want to do. So if you want to withdraw some fiat currency like euros, US dollars, British pounds out of your Binance account into your bank account, again, you have to go to the wallet right here, click on overview. And then again, you want to go to withdraw right here. And now instead of crypto, we want to make sure this is set to fiat. And then you can decide on what kind of fiat currency you want to withdraw. So right now it's set to euros. You could also change this down here. And then you can decide on different transferring methods. So the cheapest one is actually the bank transfer. So you can choose bank transfer right here. Then on the right side, you want to choose the amount you want to withdraw to your bank account. So we can just type in, let's say, 100 euros because I have 100 euros sitting around in my account. 
Then here you can see the fee, the transaction fee, and also the limit. So if you have the basic verification set up, then you have a limit of 50,000, um, I think, euros um, that you're gonna be able to withdraw in one single day. And once everything looks good here, we can click on continue. Then here you're gonna have to type in your IBAN number or whatever account information they ask of you here of your bank account. And again, the receiver account name, so your bank account name needs to be the same as the name of your Binance account. Otherwise, they won't be able to finish the withdrawal. Then once everything looks good here, you can click on confirm withdrawal and then they will send uh, your fiat currency back to your bank account. This was actually a segment of my complete Binance tutorial that is also available here on YouTube. So if you wanna learn more about Binance, you can watch that video. I'm gonna leave a link down below in the description. Also, if you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up and also leave me a comment down below if you have any questions or comments. Now, if you wanna see more videos just like this one, make sure you subscribe to the channel as well. And with that being said, thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.